Hey everyone, so today I am doing this double eye makeup look, four eyes, creepy, trippy, I don't even know what you want to call this. I had the best time creating this. I actually found the inspiration on Pinterest a while ago. Um, if you watch my daily vlogs, you would have seen it. So I decided to recreate it on myself in my own little way. I don't know, I just rolled with it. So I'm just applying my makeup as per normal at the moment. You'll see here while I'm setting my foundation down, I'm not actually putting any on my cheeks where I'm going to be drawing the eyes because I want to be able to blend easily and, you know, erase stuff easily if I have to. So first off, I am doing my eyebrows, my normal set of eyebrows. So I'm using a gel and then a little light brow mascara on top of that as well. So now I'm just plotting out where my eyes are going to be, my fake eyes. So I'm just doing some little dots with an eyebrow pencil. You can use like white eyeliner or something as well if you want. Um, so I'm just plotting this out using my nose as a guide and then I'm going to start copying my eyebrows onto my face. And I'm just using a few different products to try and make it look as realistic as possible. And I'm doing really small strokes as well just to get a hairy effect, you know. I'm then going underneath those fake brows with a light colored concealer and blending that out just to highlight my fake brow bone. You know what I'm saying. And then I'm going to use a white eyeliner to kind of begin to copy the shape of my eyes as best I can. I actually switched out for a gel, like a white gel eyeliner because it was a little bit easier to use. So I'm just doing that here on both sides and then I'm starting to fill it in. And obviously this is just going to be where the eyeball is. <laughs> Then using this kind of brown eye product um, just to outline the eye where my natural eyes have an outline so I'm kind of doing the tear duct and the lash lines around my eyes this is really hard for me to explain it's honestly like a lot easier if you just watch what I'm doing and kind of replicate it on yourself it's kind of one of those things that you learn by just doing I guess um, I'm also using this as my crease color like creating a fake crease on my eye um, so I'm just copying the shape of my natural crease on my natural eyes and then copying it down below and I'm also doing a little bit of a crease underneath my eyes where I have a natural kind of shadow under there as well just to make the eyes kind of look a little bit more 3d it's kind of hard I don't know Now I'm doing a super, super simple kind of eyeshadow look. I'm just taking one color and putting that all over the lid and into the crease and also on the lower lash line as well. And then I'm literally just gonna copy that on the bottom as well. So I'm just gonna put it on the lid and then the fake crease, if that makes sense. Now I'm just defining my lash line, well my fake lash line, with this dark dark brown eyeshadow. So I'm just putting that, you know, where my fake lash line would or should be. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. You can see what I'm doing right. <laughs> and then I am going in with a dark blue um, gel creamy product. You could use eyeshadow, you could use just whatever you could use face paint and I am just drawing on my eye color basically and I'm using a couple different shades of blue just to give some dimension you could copy your natural eye color I was planning on doing that but obviously I failed really really badly and you'll notice that I'm leaving a gap down the very bottom where the color is because that is my waterline so just make sure you do that and then I'm just adding pupils and I'm adding like a little ring around the outside I'm also adding a little white dot of like reflection as well and then just whitening up those pupils a little bit. I mean, not pupils, eye whites. You know what I mean. Now I am just highlighting my inner corners of my four eyes. Um, I'm using a really shimmery product just to give a little bit more dimension since obviously the look is quite flat and you want to kind of bring out 
the eyes a little bit if that makes sense make them look a little bit less flat and then I'm doing mascara and then on my bottom eyes I am just using falsies because it's a lot easier than drawing on lashes so I'm using these lower lashes by EXO Beauty and just popping those along that lash line and then the top lashes I'm using are called the innocent by EXO Beauty and they're from the natural set so just pop those on and I actually added a little bit of mascara on top of those just to make them look a little bit less perfect and a little bit more like natural and then after that I am just finishing off everything with a nice bright lip color and of course you can do absolutely anything you want I just wanted a color that would contrast against the blue eye color I chose for my fake eyes so I think it came out really well it stands out and hopefully you found a little bit of inspiration I love you guys so much please thumbs up if you enjoyed this and I will talk to you soon bye Hey everyone, so today's makeup look, Halloween look I should say, is this stapled face, I don't even know, um, 